Welcome to the Addison Road Community Centre, one of the largest and longest running community centres in Australia. This is a nine acre piece of land that is home to more than 30 buildings, 43 organisations, 165 trees and countless non-human animals. The centre is cared for and managed by a not-for-profit, the Addison Road Community Centre organisation for the benefit of the community. Those of us who are fortunate to be part of this community are the inheritors of the traditional owners of this land, the Gadigal people of the Eora Nation. We acknowledge their long, deep and responsible custodianship of this land and its forest and wetland, its creeks and creatures, and we draw inspiration from their example. We acknowledge that the people of the Eora Nation have never ceded the sovereignty of their land and we pay tribute to the ongoing struggle for justice, respect and recognition by and for all Indigenous Australians. Oh hello guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Ernest and I love sharing my thoughts through lifestyle, awareness, travel tips and gratitude. I am currently here at Reverse Garbage in Marrickville so the only way to come here is to take a bus or to take a train and then all you have to do is walk all the way to Addison Street. So aside from the Reverse Garbage which is a lot of people comes here, artists alike, people just wanted to create some stuff. They go here to shop those secondhand items that they can find. So reverse garbage is actually here to save any materials um, from going into the landfill and um, it's more of like renewing the value of making them available to the public. So a lot of them are here at reverse garbage. Put the link in the descriptions below of their website. So whenever you get a chance to visit Markville area, come to Addison at reverse garbage and you'll find everything trinkets from clothing that's secondhand that you can find it and use it for your own good so i'll show you around and come and join me while you made it here to my channel please don't forget to subscribe and smash that bell button so also if you are an artist or a fashion designer or you're just still studying on how to design and create for your collections you can come here at Reverse Garbage and buy affordable stuff that you can find. They're secondhand though, but what you can do is you can just wash them and reuse them. So it's 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 great. Well, the mission of the Reverse Garbage um, here at Marrickville is, you know, any materials that you no longer use will end up to the hands of people who can reuse them. So it's more about reusing, reducing and recycling effect. So, um, so to reduce your waste, disposal costs, and your carbon footprints by donating your um, discards and leftover stuff that you can find at home or offices and anything. part of the growing community of artists, sculptors, set designers, and costume makers who rely on reverse garbage to help bring back creative ideas to life. They also run workshops for kids, adults, and community groups so everyone can learn how to consume less and make more.
so every weekend here at the Markville site or area you find the um, organic markets um, every weekend and they are located at 162 Addison Road in Markville and this is to support the farmers here in Australia so all of these ones are organic and fresh produce that you can find here um, aside from having all those fresh produce there's so much a lot of things going on such as um, great artisans that you can find here in Marrickville area and it's an area where you can also sit down and relax and also get a, get a chance to enjoy the sun on a weekend so this is a pure vegan food um, so it's sold here at the Marrickville organic markets on every weekend and um, it's called chickpea curry so you'll find it by Alicia's underscore Sydney's through Instagram and um, you can ask more information about the menu for the weekend mind you it's really tasty kind to give me this to try it out for the first time and we'll see If you get the chance, please visit the organic markets so you can also help those um, people who are selling here. It would really meant a lot for them if you can buy their products and produce. Also next in the area is the Bauer Reuse and Repair Center. So they pioneered the programs to also reduce the amount of waste entering the landfill by reclaiming household items for reuse, repair and resale at affordable prices and also by encouraging communities to engage in different pre-loved goods. So as a environmental charity, they also help educate the community about reuse and repair. It's part of their charitable missions. If you are in the area, there are currently workshops that has been taught or any locations within the city of Sydney. So if you get the chance, you can also visit the website at bauer.org.au to get more information. Next in 142 Addison Road is also a home for the Fair Trade Emporium Center. When you buy Fair Trade products, you're also helping people to earn a fair price for their own work, which is only fair, right? So Fair Trade is an answer to this. Fair Trading is a trading partnership based on a dialogue, transparency and respects that seeks greater quality for producers farmers, artisans, and workers.
Addison Road Community Organizations is not for profit fighting for social justice, supporting arts and culture, and caring for our environment. They manage a nine acre heritage site in the heart of the Inner West, one for community use in 1976.